Lego stand at the moment at the school's project area and I've got with me three children here who are dealing with the Lego and we're just going to talk to them now. Hello. Yeah. What do you think of the show so far and what, what are you doing with your Lego? We're making them all work and it's just working now. On one is that one there, the red one. And switch on two is the green one, so the switch on one is both of those. You go to, did you build it all at, at your school yeah. and then you brought it here to, yeah. to um, the next project now? Okay, and thank you very much for all your help on this. Did you want to say anything else, Martin? No? Okay then, thank you very much. Okay, so on to the competition proper. Up to Anthony. Yeah. Rub him down gently. Have you got your spikes on? He's got the spikes on. He's ready. Angle now. Fly, fly, gentlemen. Go, yes! Ladies and gentlemen, Matthew here scored 4,700 points. I don't know if you remember what Anthony scored. Anthony scored 4,800 points. So a round of applause for both players. That was, that was a very, very tight work. Who's going to present the silver medal? Silver medal to Matthew. You go. On you go. Well done. Would you like to present the gold medal? And 
Anthony O'Brien, who's come here from New Malden today. Congratulations. And for you, we also have a bag, but don't run away still. This one looks like someone's trodden on it, but I'm sure it's okay. Because we have something to decorate your mantelpiece. Perhaps you'd like to present that. Anthony O'Brien, give me the Christmas Gold Award tonight. Well, thank you very much, ladies and gentlemen. Particular thanks to Marcus Adam and Dalton Grant for joining us here this afternoon. From the Whitsford stand with Glyn Williams. I'll pass you over to him and we'll hear all about his new software. Well, we've written our new software, which is called Talking Pictures, especially for our daughter, who is uh, three and a half years old now. She was two and a half when we started um, writing the software. Um, she's been using it ever since the age of two and a half, and it's amazing how quickly the children pick up uh, what they're doing. The software is basically a colouring program for little children. They um, pick a colour on the left-hand side of the screen and the computer then speaks using a human voice, which is actually mine, um, the name of the colour and then they choose the object within the uh, window on the right-hand side of the screen and the computer will then speak the name of the object as well. I, see. So I suppose that children do learn to speak English or Welsh much quicker and easier this way. I think it teaches them certainly the names of the colours, it teaches them the names of the objects in the picture um, and it also teaches them how to use the computer so they get a bit of confidence in that and certainly it teaches language, there's no doubt about that, she picks up things very quickly. Yeah. I hope that you'll be um, e exhibiting with us next year and um, I hope you have a very good show indeed, thanks a lot. Thank you. My name's Crazy Chris, what's my name? Crazy Chris. And why do they call me Crazy Chris? Because you're crazy. Wait, here we are. Ah, oh, what's your name, sir? Luke. Where? What's your name? Luke. Oh, that's your name. Right. Can you just stand there on that trap door? Thank you. Right. Are you ready? Now, Luke, hold your hand out like that. Wear your hand over the top of the handkerchief. Say, one smart fella, he felt smart. Yeah, they one say. smart fella, he felt smart. Two smart fellas, they both felt smart. Two smart fellas, they... <laughs> Two smart fellas, they both felt smart. Two big fellas, they... Oh, he couldn't open the window, please. Right. Three smart fellas, they all felt smart. Three smart, smart fellas, all smart. <laughs> <laughs> right, no. you don't get this on the BBC. Right, are you ready? No. Don't pick your nose, please. The floor's just been swept. And on I count to three, I want you to blow. Come on, ready? One, two, three, blow. Ah, look at that. Can you blow? I want that handkerchief back. Blow. Whoop. Oh, look at that, give him another big clap. How did I do that? Shall I tell you how I did it? I did it very, very well. That's how I did it. Well, this is Crazy Chris, Wembley, News at 10. <laughs>